The U.S. Army has signed a $43.55 million deal with defense technology company Epirus to supply state-of-the-art microwave weaponry aimed at neutralizing drone swarms. Under the agreement finalized on July 17, 2025, Epirus will deliver two advanced IFPCHPM Generation 2 systems, including related gear, replacement components, and technical support for testing and integration. These directed energy systems are built on Epirus' cutting-edge Leonidas platform and utilize bursts of high-powered microwave energy to disable or destroy drones in flight. Designed to safeguard sensitive facilities from unmanned aerial systems, UAS, the weapons offer a mobile, rapid response solution to an escalating global threat. The upgraded Gen 2 variant reportedly boasts a 2-kilometer effective range, more than twice that of its predecessor, and delivers a 30% boost in output strength. Another notable enhancement is its ability to function independently for up to half an hour using onboard batteries, eliminating the need for external power during field operations. Epirus had previously supplied four Gen I systems to the Army in 2024, which were field tested in joint exercises and operational deployments. These trials informed the development of the more powerful and efficient second generation. Deliveries for the new batch are scheduled to begin at the end of July, with additional units arriving in August and September. Drones are now a persistent threat, from incursions over domestic military facilities and the southern U.S. border to coordinated attacks abroad. Our Leonidas system offers a scalable solution to meet that challenge head-on, said Epirus CEO Andy Lowry. Microwave-based drone defense is gaining international traction. The British military, for instance, has been testing its own radio frequency direct energy weapon, RFDW, which reportedly downed over 100 drones during trials earlier this year, including two entire swarms in a single operation.